task 3.5 is to set document numbering format. In this task, we will learn how to set our own document numbering format. If previous task, I always mentioned to you that we always need to follow the system numbering. Now, we want to create our own numbering so that in a later task, we will use the numbering that we create on our own. So, to go to the set document numbering format, first you have to click on the general maintenance and after that you need to go to document num numbering format maintenance after you click here you can see there's a few category for the numbering format we have category gl manufacturing others purchase sales and stock so now refer to your cost uh, cost book task 3.5 on the first line the first category that we want to create our numbering is category GL. So, we highlight category GL and then we click on the plus sign to expand it. So, under category GL, we have few document type. We have journal entry, bank slip, cash receipt and cash payment. So, then on the same line, but the next details that we have is document type. So, the document type of the numbering that we want to create is cash receipt. So, you highlight cash receipt and then you expand it. Under cash receipt, there is a one numbering. This numbering is the system numbering. So, we don't want to use this numbering anymore. So, what we can do, we want to create our new one. To create a new numbering for cash receipt, what you need to do is... After you highlight the document type cash receipt, you go to the new button at the top and you can start to key in your own numbering format. So the first one name is OR-CASH. Document type is OR. Next number is 10001. The format is or dash bracket one two three four five so after you key in the format you can see on your right side there is a sample of your numbering so this will be your numbering of or dash one zero 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 one after you finalize all the details to save you can just click OK button. That is for the first numbering that we want to create. The second numbering is category GL, document type cash receipt. Okay, we are still in the same document type. So we create a new one. The name is ORCIMB, document type OR. Next number will be 7. 77789. So the format here you may need to change to OR dash one two three four five. And after that we click OK. The third one, the category is GL, but the document type is cash payment. So what you need to do is you need to highlight the cash payment document type and expand it. So we want to create a new one. So we click on new button. The name is CPV. Document type is PV. The next number is 9001. The format is CPV dash one, two, three, four, and close it. After that, you can ju you just click OK button. The fourth numbering that we want to create is under category purchase. So what you can do is you need to highlight category purchase and expand it. So under category purchase, the document type is purchase invoice. So highlight document type purchase invoice and we create a new numbering. 
So the new numbering is PINV. Document type is PI. Next number is 55. The format is PINV dash 1234. And after that, you just click OK. And the last one for the numbering format is category sales so i highlight category sales and the document type is invoice so i highlight invoice and i click on new button the name is inv document type iv next number is one format is inv dash one two three four and after that you click on save so basically you have set all the numbering format but before we proceed to the next instruction you can see for the purchase invoice and for the sales invoice there is a note there saying you saying that we need to make it this numbering as set as default so how are we going to do the purchase invoice set as default first you have to go to the document type purchase invoice which is this one highlight the document type purchase invoice and then after that click on manage button currently PI, PI default is the default we want to change to PINV so to change the default you need to highlight the PINV and then you need to click on the set as default document number format then only the default will change after that you can just close and do for the next one which is sales invoice so I highlight document type invoice manage I highlight INV set as default and close by right the system already uh, changed the default for the numbering but in your page here it haven't refreshed so if you want to refresh you need to close everything and open back so for this one I just close and we proceed to the second instruction the second instruction says that to assign the default numbering format for payment methods there's a two step there first is by go to general maintenance payment method maintenance and another one is by go to gl account maintenance i would suggest to you to follow the second step because it's much more easier so to go to the uh, payment method default numbering you follow second step which is go to gl and then account maintenance so under your account maintenance you need to find the payment uh, bank account which is for cimb kl so payment method for cimb kl highlight cimb kl edit account and you have to go to the bottom column on the bottom column here you can see the column is specifically for document numbering format so in here the payment document number format is PV default okay the same but for the receipt document number we need to change to OR CIMB so after that you just click on save button the next one is cash but in our system cash in hand so what you need to do you highlight cash in hand edit account and under document numbering format here you change the payment document number format to CPV and the receipt document number to OR cash and you save so after you have assigned the default numbering format for payment method you can close from the account maintenance and go back to the home page <music>